Johnny wants to ask you out on a date. What do you think? Johnny's asking? Or is it you? Johnny, you're the one who said you got no trouble telling us apart. Okay. And where'd we go? Where'd you want to go? Silver Pixel Cloud in North Oak. Okay. I'll swing by the afterlife. Pick you up. Some crew taking you along as bait? That a compliment? You look... different. <laughs> Try again. Maybe you'll find some charm third time around. Hey, Rogue. Ready? Again, you. We going? Where's Johnny? Couldn't make it after all? I'm just your driver. See you keep him on a short leash. <laughs> Wise beyond your years. This Johnny's Porsche? <laughs> Where'd you get it? That's what was in the container. The one Grayson was talking about. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Got a lot of memories in this car. Let's go. Silver Pixel Cloud, your favorite place? Once, probably. Haven't been there in ages. Drive-ins went out of style a century ago. But Silver Pixel's still hanging in there. Sounds like a preen place for a date. Thought so too. Which is why I suggested Johnny take me there. A million years ago. So it wasn't his idea. Of course not. His idea of a romantic night out was blowing up our Osaka HQ. Johnny doesn't do a thing without an ulterior motive. So what's in play this time? Johnny's changed. He really does want to spend some time with you. No hooks, no lines, no sinkers. Right. Selfless Johnny Silverhand. Apparently, you're a positive influence on him. Here we are. Oh, I don't believe it. It really has been years. Managed to shut the whole thing down. V, try to get inside. Can't stop us, won't stop us. We asked you out on a date. All right. Do your thing. I'll watch. Okay, gotta be the past, this. Guess we really are going to the movies. Let's go. Shalala. Well done. Try and get the projector started. I'll get us some seats. Sure thing. Right, let's go check the projector. Entrance is over here. Okay, looks like I found the projector. You wouldn't happen to know how to get it up and running. About to see. Look at that. Glass plate Bushido 10. Perfect. Looks like a spurt of runny shit. V, we're at a drive-in. Movie's the last thing we care about. Just want some background noise. A little blood, tits, and gore. That sort of thing. Bushido will give you that. All right, V, run along. I'll take it from here. <sighs> 
So, you ready? Have fun, you crazy kids. Grabbed us the best spots. Hop on up. This is how you imagine this evening going. Always knew things would have to change for us to just go out and catch a movie. Never imagined they'd change this much. Let's pretend it's 2015, huh? We just met, and I got no idea what a bastard you are. Sure, lured you to the movie so we could bang, by the way. <laughs> It's technically a possibility, you know. Okay, so it's 2015. If you could do it all again, what would you change? Anything at all? I guess Smasher, before he got me. And maybe plan more charges in that tower. So you do the exact same thing, just better. Hey, hey, hey. What's this? Nothing. It's just... I had a lot of time to think while you were away. What ifs and all that. All that counts is I'm back. With you. I think that's way better than any what if. But all we got's this one night. It's more than I ever could have asked for. Rogue, I'm here on borrowed time in a borrowed body. But I'm here. Johnny, I can't. It's not right. <sighs> mean it not fair to V? Not fair to you. Tried so hard to pretend nothing's changed. To pretend I'm the same rogue you knew. Actually managed to fool myself for a little. <sighs> Get back on my own. Rogue! Fuck. Things did not go swimmingly. 
Nope. Was gonna be a nice night at the drive-in. Now she's mad and won't tell me what about. Any guesses? Remember Grayson? How they spoke? How weird it was? Weird's not the word, I don't think. He was toying with her. Could be something to that. Got a mullet over. For now, take me to North Oak. That's supposed to help you figure out Rogue? No. Carrie. Tell you once we're there. Movie was a turd wrapped in crepe paper. This ought to work. Well, so why are we here exactly? Heard Carrie got himself a buck of mansion here. Done well. Where'd you hear anything about Carrie? In and about town. Scream sheets are full of shit about him. Oh, right. You weren't around. Mm-hmm. Your big night out. So what? Wanna pay him a visit? Yep. Seems as good a time as any. So I gotta hit Carrie's digs, look around, critique the drapes. You know what they're writing about him? He's depressed, attempted suicide. What, really worried he wants to hurt himself? Who knows? Either way, could give him some pointers. Meaning you want to hurt yourself. Gotta hand you the reins again. Yes. Behaved myself last time, didn't I? I think I warrant another furlough for good behavior. What was that about attempted suicide? Amateur hour. Didn't even cobble together the right audience. Tried to put a bullet through his skull in his room. Bodyguard took his gun like candy from a baby. Could just be the rumor mill. Sure, could. But I want to know. Okay. But I want to know what you plan to do. Nothing stupid, I promise. Just want to see how he's doing. How you plan to tell him it's you? Could be dealing with some real personal shit right now. Might not be the best time to mess with his head. V-Care was always dealing with personal shit. That's why in spite of everything else, we got along. Don't worry. I'll play it by ear, sensitively. First things first. We gotta get into that house. Okay. Just let me know when you want to take the wheel. Seafood barf. Hope it was expensive at least. Something's gotta justify this level of tacky. <laughs> Fuck. Cookie cutter crap straight from a catalog. Doubt Carrie picked this. Always ate out. Always. Oh. Beautiful butterfly carry emerging from his silky samurai chrysalis. All right, I'll give him that one. Probably the only actual necessity in this whole pad. What's... Second conflict. Carried always goes straight for kitsch with titles. Guess nothing's changed. Wicked bad collection. Well, now I am impressed. Played a few of these myself back in our samurai days.
Looks like he's showering. Alone, too. Good thing, believe me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. Drop one of Misty's special pills. Let's go. Okay. Ah, oh, feels so much better. Now let's see which you're up for show and which you're actually strummable. Keep playing. Silverhand tell me before he died. I told you to stop being a pussy. Did you? Huh? Johnny fucking Silverhand. Fuck. I mean, how? Surprise. Motherfucker! Okay. Weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh, fucking contraire. Been waiting 50 years to do that. She had changed a bit. Sporting a new style, trying to stay hip. Not looking all bad yourself, either. Shit. Johnny. Oh, man. I need a drink. All right. Come on. Tell me. Why do you look like a small-time kleptopunk from the afterlife? This is V. You like him. The fuck, Donnie? Doesn't explain a thing. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Moved in after the fourth album came out. All sold well, apparently. Fuck you, Johnny. Don't even start. Who'd you sign with? Shit. With Arasaka. Mornings, I record at their studio. Then evenings, Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Hmm. And who'd you really sign with? MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Come on. Sit down with me. Tell me where you've been all this time. Live here all by your lonesome? Nah, I've got my cook, Ariel, but... He's off today. Miguel... What am I... Not your biz, Jim. Sit down. Start talking. Steal yourself for a long story. I just really want it to be tragic. As sad as all fuck over all those years. Cause if I hear you spent them with the nomads, open road, winning your hair, or cool and relaxed in orbit, and now you've just popped by to shit all over my life? Well, I'ma lose my damn mind. Oh, it is a heartbreaker. Oh, fuck! Remember? The one damn time Henry showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh-huh, and played absolute tripe. At least Danny was happy. Stuff about you being depressed. It's true. Nope. Promo stratagem. Suicide attempts too. Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Now you're just butthurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me, got no answer to that. Looking at him now, those really were the best of times. Playing fucking rat-infested dumps, 
argued before every gig. Had no idea what we wanted to play, and never had an Ed do our name. Nancy? Control freak. Henry smelled like zappers and piss. I was always stealing your pants. Hella good times, man. Who's that? Louise. The ex-wife. The what? Huh, <laughs> you're kidding. How long did it last? Eh, hey, too long. But don't worry, it worked out well. For her. Gave her my house in Tokyo, cars, kids, yeah. Worked out pretty well for you too then. Never did get what Denny saw in that guy. I mean, smart in that one. Maybe too smart for the company she kept. Nah, Denny always went for losers, incapable of dressing themselves. Oh, Hank was perfect. Half a brain and high all the time. She got to rescue him over and over again. Why'd she never try and fix me? Would have had to get in line, that's why. Still in touch with the gang. Just Nance. Changed her name to Bess Isis. Works for N54 News. Could track down Denny and Henry if you want. Maybe get together? You know, jam or something? Best Isis, damn, Nance really went for it. Though all I hear is part-time stripper with a thing for ancient Egypt. Shame you died. Sure she would have welcomed your input. How is she in general, besides having nothing to do with music? Could ask her yourself. You want to bring Samurai back? Nah, no. Could do one gig, play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. But I won't have to explain what happened, all this. Nah. We'll spare him. Hella boring story. Biochips, Arasaka's evil schemes, magic pills. We'll just say you're my new input. All right, let's do it. Fuck yeah! Okay! Send you Nancy's number in a sec. I'll go after Henry and Denny. Hmm, I'm not there, figure it out with V. Sure, uh, you two get along? Not lately, no. We don't have much of a choice, though. How am I? Johnny, you okay? No. Ah, go. You must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. You two have fun at least? <laughs> that a hint of disapproval I hear? Just sit tight for a bit. Rest. Don't worry about a thing. What the hell is this concert thing? Did you hear that? Get sharper as the pills wear off. So? Wanna see Samurai live? Probably won't get another chance. Okay, calling Nancy. Fuck yeah, nice. Uh, Nancy? Uh, I mean, the uh, best. Best Isis? No, this is her underpaid, underappreciated assistant. Steven, N54 News, how can I help? Want to talk to Bess? She's not here. 
Call him from Kerry Uridine's residence. Cool. But Beth still isn't here. She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Totentons to shoot some stuff, story on Maelstrom. Call back next week or just watch the news. If anything happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. Got a bad feeling, V. Think we better head to the Taunton Tents. Like your style. Minimalist. Used to have chrome just like that. Start moving. Tents too? Fuck yeah. Third floor. Hey, press the button. Well, my fingers are numb. from all foods that's the juma cluck the spider bot no 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 wouldn't be that stupid to show here you the one don't know what you're talking about yeah that's him uh, look at this river a chance of yeah. making the barrel get the fuck Need out now that's the all foods punk I'm not blind what do you want sounds like it Watch what happened for that one I shouldn't talk about this on the hollow. We gotta meet. When and where? Tell me. Glenn, tonight. I'll flick you the details. Will you make it? Do my best. Thanks, V. Till then. Best Isis. Mean anything to you? You work with her? No. Just gotta talk. Heard she's here. Gotta talk! Sure! I'll take you! Too easy to scope. To be honest, should be thanking you! For what? All Foods incident worked out pretty well for me. Pleasure's all mine. Carrie Uridine sent me. Carrie? Fuck, I do not get this. Uh-uh. Must have spent too much time with paranoid Patty in there. It's about Samurai. Talk later, okay? Right. Let's Delta. Follow me up. 
Get us out of here. I swear I won't do Elevate. anything. To Over you. there. Let's go. A waste of time. I've had better days. That gonquette was sure I was a goddamn spy. Okay, come on. Still where I parked it. Why'd you come here, really? Wanted to do a story on the music at the Totentans. <laughs> no wonder Patricia didn't buy your story. Could have been worse. This way you got a souvenir. Fuck souvenirs. I'm headed straight back to the editing room. Wanna talk? Gotta come with me. Something like this. Hope it gets us there in one piece. All right. So what's Carrie want? Wants to bring back samurai. One gig, one night. There is no samurai without Silverhand. I'll play for Johnny. <laughs> you. Let's just say Silverhand was more visionary than musician. I got this. Trust me. Well, if you got Carrie on board, what's in it for me? I believe I just saved your ass. Too bad you couldn't wait until after I'd gotten some footage. Ugh. Bag. Wish I'd stop by when that other guy was in charge. Royce. No, you really don't. Believe me. We're here. Hop out. All right, so... The concert? <sighs> Tell Carrie I'll put it together. Be in touch. Okay, thanks. Went pretty damn well. Now call Carrie. Hey, 
So how'd it go? Tough to dance? Yep. She agreed. Even said she'd organize the gig. Still a control freak. Awesome. Managed to contact Henry or Danny? Just Henry so far. Dragged him out of rehab. Great story, actually. Henry didn't know. Denny's been in Night City all this time. On his way over to see her now. Gonna be a surprise. We're all gonna meet over at Denny's. What, me too? Why? Gonna play with us, aren't you? Gotta meet the others. Send you the address. Get in touch with the administration at North Oak, Colorado. See those? Mm, what happened here? She must have been renovating. Henry must have borrowed the truck. Gonk always was good at improvising. Maybe they're home. Try the intercom. Right then. Guess we keep looking. Sadly for me. What are you doing here? Uh, good you're here. We this got a problem. This is your house? This is supposed to be Henry's this surprise. This is your fucking pool? Yeah, I obviously missed a few beats. You're gonna pay for Looks this, like you piece of shit! He's holding some sort of grudge. You bet so I he will. flooded the pool Just so with I can concrete. Come back again. Henry did often get Maybe emotional. Then you'll tell me why the hell you left me to die in the street! What about Left the concert? Die. I haven't gotten a chance to Ugh, ask Denny I wish yet. You would Doesn't look die. good, though. V, talk Why to them. Carrie will just make it worse. Uh, get the fuck not really out. my biz. Go, go. They'll get past it in what, a second. now? Already? Carrie didn't piss no. off. This your backup? In case you forgot why the hell you came here in the first place? Carrie sent me. It's about the concert. What concert? Why isn't he here talking to me? We'll bring it back Samurai, one night only. That's what he wants to get the crew together for? Sweet, but no fucking way. Not about to play with this shit stain. Danny! No, no way. Either him or me. Choose. Danny digs in her heels, we're done. How's it going? Like shit, man! Danny wants me out of the gig! And we already agreed on everything! What? Carrie's paying you? That's what this is about? Fuck. It's all fucking great. So you get him away from me and get the fuck off my lawn. Don't make me choose. Maybe if someone would tell me what happened. Are you blind? Fucker filled my pool with cement. Maybe he had a good reason. Really? A reason? Gotta go without one or the other. Uh, yeah, not a problem. Should be able to borrow someone else for one gig. Won't be the same, though. It won't ever be the same, Kerry. Ugh, if we gotta choose, let's play with Danny. Fuck, Kerry! Seriously? She's the one making a big deal out of this, not me! Listen, I'll get you. You know what, Kerry? Fuck you! Good thing Silverhand isn't here to see this. You done? Get out. All right, what about Nancy? We make contact. She's gonna set it all up and let us know. See you at the show. Fuck. Now I gotta find someone to clean this up. Okay, about all we can do for now. Except to wait for Nancy to call. Where there's smoke. Well, this is the place. Tick, 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 tick. Can I not 
explode and flood. The cult hit music of the corporate force is back in theaters near you. Hey, V. How you holding up? Been better. I know. Probably not hard to tell. So, what happened? Needed someone to talk to. Uh-huh. First, take a look. Hello, my name is Arif Iqbal, and this is WNS News. Today's More dead politicians. Just watch it. ...led the NCPD to the trail of a dangerous abductor and murderer. The incident occurred at the intersection of 7th and 15th Avenue. The following police footage was captured at the scene. 1038, I repeat at 1038. Registration 2AA6244. We're exiting our vehicle now. Copy that. Out of the car! Hands up! Easy, officer. Relax. Shut your mouth! Oh, shit. Ah! Uh, we have a 1053 and a 1054. I repeat, a 1053 and a 1054. The boy from the footage is Lavar Martinez, age 17. His parents reported his disappearance over a month ago. Unfortunately, Lavar's life could not be saved. His body could not withstand the severe septic shock he suffered. Autopsy reports revealed the teenager was given dangerously high levels of hormones, anabolic steroids, and stimulants. The possessions and genetic material of seven other missing teens were also found in the car, belonging to one Anthony Harris. Unfortunately, their fates remain unknown. Although the criminal widely known as Peter Pan survived the gunshot, he has not regained consciousness. This, uh, Peter Pan, he in no case? You were looking for him? Never heard of him. Didn't cross my desk. What's the problem if they caught the guy? My nephew, Randy. Disappeared not long past. And what you just saw? The kid was wearing Randy's shoes. Ah, oh, Jesus. Randy's disappearance. You know anything else? My sister and I don't get along that well. Uh, I don't know much. Just wish I could have been there for her when she needed it most. And what, they figured you'd get emotional and kept you off the case? More like a restraining order. Won't let me anywhere near it. Gonagal took the lead on it. Lazy-ass gonk. And so far, he ain't accomplished shit. No way I'd let this lie. I know. And that's why I'm asking for your help. So what do we need to do? Can't interrogate the guy because he's a veg, but... We can view his dreams. I'm sorry, dreams? You heard me. Come on, I'll explain on the way. It's an experimental procedure, but it's already yielding results. They record dreams that can be played back as BDs. You got access to these dreams? Not yet. But they keep them in the lab we're headed to now. Got an appointment? Not exactly. We'll go in together, but, uh... Not through the main entrance. Oh, we're gonna break the law? We'll find a different way in, and then hustle out quick. Never actually been here, so I'll need your help.
How are we gonna find this brain dance? Look for a room where they edit the dreams of autistic kids. Oh, and remember, Peter Pan's real name is Anthony Harris. They definitely don't store any BDs in this area. Hey, River. I think I got it. Found something? Not yet. Anthony Harris. Let's try these drawers. Say, River, why not just have a janitor crack a door for you? Can't risk getting scolded for sniffing around somebody else's River. case. Yoan! What are you doing here? You got kicked off the force! Just suspended, actually. Who might you be? I'm calling the actual police. Oh, wait, 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 here. Hear me out, please. Seriously, River? You weren't in enough trouble already? Harris kidnapped my nephew. I'm sorry. Really, I am. But we store evidence here. And we have strict protocols. Protocols? Talking about his nephew's life here. A child's life. This is an ongoing police investigation. Go, please. Get out now! We can't leave without Peter Pan's dreams. I'll say it one last time. Out! Damn it, Yawin. Who the fuck do you think you are? Remember your first med school exam? You know the one. Passed it with flying colors. Gotta remember it. Ladies' room erupted in flame. They evacuated everybody for two hours. I cannot believe you would throw that in my face. I never wish to see you here again. Especially you. You don't know him well, do you? This man is a bastard. River and I get along, we're friends. Hasn't let me down yet. Huh, I thought us friends too. Is that why you're refusing to help him out? Harris is dream beady. Where is it? He isn't dreaming. What? Why? A bullet damaged his cerebral cortex. We get only dissonant urges. Pieces. I'd like to try audiovisual stimulation. But he isn't on the spectrum. A favorite song or movie helps you reach the kids. Might be worth a try. I am aware of the similarity. Hypothalamus stimulation and hormone production. But Harris is not a child. I have never tried the procedure on an adult. Let's try it. We don't even know his preferences. I'll find something. I mean you're willing to try? Just... Go. I'll open the front door for you. Let's ride, V. I know exactly where to start. Say, by the way, what do you know about biochips? Arasaka's relic in particular.
Okay. Let me hear it. So, got booted off the force. Uh, suspended. Mayor's death stank to high heaven. Inquest into, kicked under the rug. So, I made a fuss. Not worth asking how you feel about that. Nope. It's just, uh... It's not easy for me to talk about when it's biting in my ass. Fair enough. Could tell me where we're headed, though. To Josser's. Randy's mom. She thinks he just ran away from home. For now, keep the kidnapping between us. Where's Randy's dad? Been a few years since he got popped. Gang war. Hmm. Great role model. Josh was left alone with three. <laughs> but she's as tough as weathered leather. Gonna tell me why we aren't trying to find Harris's apartment? That's a house. And I doubt he's keeping his victims in his basement. And besides, we are trying. Want to see if we can find some connection to Harris at Randy's. Pretty weak lead. Best we can hope for just now. You think y'all want to actually help us? All things considered? Yeah. These tiffs of ours always end up the same way. I'll tell you about it over a beer sometime. Really ought to focus on finding Randy now. Of course. All right. This is it. It's sure been a while. He used to come over every weekend. Kind of go. And? Changed it all since? Places like this never change. Lovely neighborhood. Mwah. River. You either got business with me or news about my Randy. Wouldn't drag your butt out here if you didn't. Joss, meet V. Sovi, is this about my Randy? Randy's been taken. Why didn't you call? Joss, I... Uh... Threw a blanket over the truth, like always. Police caught the guy, but he caught a bullet and he's in a coma, being watched. But where's Randy? We're looking, Joss. Here? Listen, we need to look through Randy's things. Why? To find any lead we can. Trust me, Joss. Just don't destroy anything. Randy doesn't like it when anyone pokes through his stuff. Let's go, V. The kids are playing outside. Tell him it's time to eat. What's on your mind? Think it's good she learned the truth. That's the trailer. Eyes peeled for details, eh? Uncle River! Monique! Dorian. Hey, guys. Is this your partner? Just a friend. You gonna stay over? We'll see. Your mom's waiting for you with dinner. This is their old trailer. 
Randy moved in when I bought him a new one. Real hellhole. Like in my good old days. You check around, I'll check the trash. Got some kind of key here. Real fossil. Not quite what we're looking for, no. Drugs? Let's not... Hmm. Society. Tainted Overlord. Favorite band. You know him well. He used to send him an album every year for his B-Day. Some kind of game here. Shipping code on it. Expensive tech. Randy had the scratch for this? You're joking. No chance Randy could afford hardware like this. Way too pricey. We gotta get in, but I doubt anyone knows the password. Can you crack it? Don't know how, River. Damn. Need to try to guess it then. What could he have? Who's the girl? His ex. Let's move. Let's go. Ex in the pig. What's her name? Natalie? Gonna have to keep trying. on me. Ooh, Liberum Arbitrium. Dark shit. Sound could use work, but you can tell they put blood, sweat, and tears into it. B. Randy looks like his tag. Mm -hmm. Punch this track title. Liberum Arbitrium. That did it. Help me have a look around. If they caught Harris in a vehicle like that. Blockaded street. Shit, River. I remember that day. He lives close to an old school. True angel of empathy, this guy, huh? I figured out Randy's identity. Sent him the game as a present. The one you found in his drawer? The same. Shipping code suggests the prick sent it from the Badlands. This guy baited Randy like a pro. Natalie must have been the only person Randy trusted. Can we view this page with a link? River, do you? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? No. There's no way. Why would he do that? Not only did they agree to meet, but it looks like Randy was as excited as any kid on his way to a theme park. This creep definitely scrambled Randy's head. Something deeply fucked about that cartoon. My skin's crawling.
some kind of link. The one Randy wrote about? Let's find out. A hidden page set up by Anthony Harris. Christ. I'm gonna be sick. Jesus, River, this is fucked. Guy preyed on troubled kids. Made habits to target boys like Randy. This is my fault. If I just paid more attention. Just talked with him more. Hey, come on. You're not the one to blame here. Hey, there look. was a file here. Near this deleted, looks like. But the name's still there. That's... that name. Wasn't the video file Randy on Randy's must have com downloaded called something it. Sure, but V, don't you get it? This could be the key to Harris's mind. Here's hoping. Hey, uh, can you use any of that Netrunner magic to shake anything else out of this? Not that kind of magician. Oh, okay. We'll have to manage without it. That cartoon, River. Could be what we've been looking for. You said yourself we needed something to get Harris to dream. Send it to Yawin. Right. Sending it now. Okay. Says she'll get back to me by morning. And that I am a son of a bitch. And, uh, eh, Come on. Let's grab a bite. Listen, let's not worry Joss more than we need to, huh? We're hot on the trail. We'll know more tomorrow. That's it. <laughs>